Queen Elizabeth's jokey relationship with her uncle King Edward VIII has been uncovered in Channel 5's documentary, Elizabeth II and the Traitor King, A Secret Friendship. King Edward VIII enjoyed a short reign and abdicated abruptly in 1936 in order to marry the twice-divorced American heiress Wallace Simpson. The crown later passed to Edward's younger brother and Elizabeth's father, King George VI. Author Hugo Vickers told the program. Apparently there were times when she would knock on his door and he would be maybe smoking a pipe at his desk. So through slightly gritted teeth as she came in he would say well don't forget your b asterisk 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 dy curtsy. Because after all she was Princess Elizabeth and he was the king. But it was like jokey, so that sort of relationship. Royal historian Professor Anna Whitelock described Edward VIII as a loving uncle to the future queen. Professor Whitelock describes a loving uncle who liked messing around, playing around with his young nieces. Certainly it suggests that he spent time around the family. With the family. Following his abdicated Edward lose his royal title and became the Duke of Windsor and relocated to France amid much scorn from British high society as well as members of his own family. Despite the rift which developed between Edward and his royal relatives over the abdication the Queen did visit him in May 1972. Mr Vickers described the encounter during a state visit to France as meaning a great deal to the Duke. He alleged, with great difficulty, the Duke rose from his bed to give his bow because, of course, she was his queen now, as well as his niece and it meant a great deal to him that she paid him this final courtesy. However, a friend of Mrs. Simpson would later accuse the queen in Vanity Fair of having shown no compassion to the Duke of Windsor and no appreciation for his effort. The Countess of Romanones told the magazine, I greeted the queen at the door downstairs. She was not at all warm to his wife of 35 years, but then, I shouldn't complain. She was just as cold to him. I escorted her upstairs. Her expression was hard when she entered the room.